Hello and welcome to the Watchman on the Wall channel. This prophetic poem comes from Tiffany Parr, McKinney, Texas. Touch my mouth, O Lord. Touch my mouth, O Lord, with your coal of fire. My heart answers your heart's cry. Send me. Look upon me, O Lord, woe is me, for I am undone. I live in a world of unclean people. Filth is all around me. Though I made a covenant with my eyes, I've consumed unclean things and seen things one should not see. I've beheld, idolized, and created high places in my mind's eye that you've never been able to touch until now. O oh God, forgive my iniquity. Cleanse my heart that I may know your ways, that I may keep your word. Follow it. Consume it. Eat the scroll you put before me. Touch my mouth that I may speak. Scrape the wax out of my ear that I may hear your word, even your whisper, your still small voice, and long for your presence once again. For you have given me the tongue of the learned, that I should know how to speak a word, make disciples in this season. You have opened my ears morning upon morning, that I may hear your word and speak a word in season to that weary one, that one who is in need, that weary one, that desperate one, one who is like me, who cannot hear and cannot see, can't eat, can't taste or feel. They've never been overshadowed by the Almighty or sat under his precious wing. They've never tasted your word to see that it is good. They've never heard your word over and over so they can walk by faith and not by sight. O oh God, how will they hear without a preacher? Here I am, Lord, send me. Here I am, Lord, send me. Lay the hot coal upon my mouth. Take away the residue from my lips, the debris that remains, that which consumes my heart that is not like you the area of my unconverted self, that room I didn't let you in. Take my feet, guide my footsteps, release my feet from the snare, set the path that I should take, placing your lamp posts along the way. Remove the crookedness from it and make it straight for me, I beseech you. Clothe me with your shoes, well fitted with the gospel of peace, for you have weakened and wakened my ear. Morning by morning, given me a word to speak to that weary one. For how will they call upon you if they have not believed? How will they believe if they haven't heard? How will they hear without a preacher? How will they go unless they are sent, that they may hear and become converted? Here I am, Lord. Send me. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this beautiful poem from our sister Tiffany. Lord, that we would be like ones who have our lips cleansed, that speak your words, Lord, words of encouragement, words that draw others to you, Father. Lord, that you would do a work in our lives, that you would forgive our iniquity, that you would forgive us when we have gone against the covenants we've made with our own eyes, Lord, and that we would pursue the weary one as your hands and feet on this earth, Lord, that you would spark in us a flame, that we would fan it into flame, Lord, a fire and a passion and a zeal for that weary one, that desperate one. Lord, that we would be sent by you to reach the lost, that lost person, by name, that person that you know, that you have a heart for. Here I am. Send me. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.